Today, Kevin and I are in our hotel room in London. In London. And we're gonna review three items for you from M&S. These were two pounds each at M&S. We have the milk chocolate honeycomb. Which you know is usually good. The milk chocolate cookie dough bites. And milk chocolate sea salt fudge bites. So first we're gonna try the honeycomb. I said that about honeycomb because we both like honeycomb. Oh yeah, honeycomb is usually Good. terrific. Like the crunchy bar is an excellent candy bar. So I can't wait to try this. It says this bag serves four and for um, a fourth of the bag is 137 calories. They group for you, don't they? They do. They get the preparation above oh. the line. <laughs> so Tammy just ripped it in two. Okay. Another one for the Ziploc bag. Now, I'm, I'm glad that we I've always bring Ziploc baggies on vacation. Always bring Ziploc bags on vacation. And uh, it's a good thing. Oh, they're not shaped like I thought they would be. Might not have. Are you sh uh, Here, just hold that. I want to make sure they're all that shape. Because I thought they would be in squares. No, they're all in that. They're all um, like longer pieces. So it's the classic honeycomb. I know you won't be able to see it. I'm gonna have a picture at the end. It's good, good combination. It's delicious. The chocolate's not too much, not too little, it's just right. Mm, like super, that. super sweet. Very, very sweet. Mm -hmm. And if you chew it, it kind of sticks in your teeth a little bit. Not bad though. Not bad, not like taffy or anything like that, but just a little bit of that sugar will stick in your teeth a little bit. It, uh, this very much reminds me of a crunchy bar. Yeah, so they're if, very good. If you like a crunchy bar and you like the size of these pieces, if that would work better for you, yeah. then you should try by I think if, if this survives while we're over here, Andrew would like those. Oh, Andrew would like those. Because he likes those too. And if they don't, we can buy more. That's true. There's, they mess across the street from us. They just open it. Yeah, yeah, which is so nice. So everybody that I have recommended this Premier in Waterloo, um, yeah, they have an M&S right across. A good big across. one, a pretty decent size. Yes, one, it's like a full-size grocery store right across the street is awesome. Mm -hmm. And a Boots. We haven't yeah, been in the Boots yet. It's a but Big Boots, too. Yeah. Okay, Big Boots. Big Boots. <laughs> um, this is the Milk Chocolate Cookie Dough Bites. Uh, they're uh, four servings. Uh, it's 171 uh, calories for a fourth of the bag milk chocolate and dark biscuit crumb with a soft white chocolate and biscuit filling. So yeah. that sounds good. They give you this little sticker on the back so you can roll it over and stick it back together. They didn't give you enough tape to just tape it together how you look. Oh, I didn't even notice that. Is that on all of them? Yeah. Oh, it is. They don't give her enough tape to open it how she opens them. This is the shape of a, <laughs> the size of a malted milk ball. A little tougher than I was thinking it would be, but I don't think of what kind of cookie that would be. Mm. It's good. That's very different. But it doesn't have like a chocolate chip. Not really a sugar cookie. You know, it's got these little sugar crystals all in it. It really, honestly, it tastes like cookie dough, though. It really does. It's like a it's like a chocolate chip cookie dough. See, I don't get the chocolate chip. Mm. It's very good. I'm not complaining about one or the other, but. Not chocolate chip. Because it doesn't have chocolate chips. No. It tastes like the basic sugar cookie dough. Maybe a sugar cookie with like mm -hmm. a Hershey's Kiss stuck in the middle or something. Mm -hmm. Something like that. That is it's, so good. It's very, very good, very sweet. I can eat like the whole bag. Yeah. It is incredibly sweet. Chocolate. I love the, the white you chocolate. You get the little sugar crystals in mm -hmm. there. I don't know where the sugar crystals come in from. I like the these more than I like the um, the honeycomb. They are definitely. I love them. Uh, better. I like the texture of them better. The flavor, sweet wise, they're they got a little more depth of flavor. You can eat these quicker too. You can pop these in your mouth, and, yeah. and, and the honeycomb they're going to slow you down a little bit. These <laughs> you just keep eating them. Um, these are the milk chocolate sea salt fudge bites, four servings. 160 calories. So which, I think the cookie dough is uh, it's got a lot more depth of their flavor, whereas the honeycomb is basically just sugar cane. It's true. It's, it's cooked sugar. No, you're right. Chocolate. I agree with you. This is milk chocolate bites with a salted fudge center. And these are a good size. Yeah, good little rectangle. The nougat. Mm. 
Should I get my own? He said just get your There's own. There's no biting that one in two. It's split the whole chocolate but Hmm. A little bit of that salty caramel flavor. Mm -hmm. Fudge, salted caramel and fudge. Yeah. Sea salt. Sea salt fudge. Mm -hmm. Not caramel, just fudge. Big thing, I really didn't get a caramel flavor. Well, there's a reason it's fudge. I like that. Yeah, it's a cho just very chocolatey. You definitely get sea salt. Mm -hmm. You don't get the little crystals of salt, but you get the flavor of the salt. Yes. I think if you ate a lot of those, it would really dry your mouth up, though. Because oh, my yeah. mouth is very dry from just that one piece. But I, agree. I love the texture of it. Mm -hmm. I love how you, you bite into that, that soft center. Um, that That is, like, super, super sweet. Uh, out of the three, honestly, I think this is sweeter than the honeycomb. Yeah, and that are. Yes, it is that sweet. So, honeycomb was like way up here. This is way up here. <laughs> it's just incredibly sweet. But it's got a good flavor too. Awesome flavor. Um, That's the thing I like the cookie dough bites better. I think out of the three, I think I would buy these. Uh, yes, I would buy any of these again. Because yeah, they're all good. I think they're all good. I think they're all worth two pounds a piece. I think you're getting your money's worth. Um, even if you don't get four servings, even if you can just half the bag, you know, half one night, half the next night yeah, or something of, like that serving. then i think that is still a really good deal so yeah if you haven't tried them i would at least try the cookie dough bites even if you don't want to try any of the other ones i would try the cookie dough bites because they're very good yeah so i hope you enjoyed the video i'm gonna have a picture for you at the end and thanks for watching